Hey guys, welcome back to Penfold Gaming for another episode of Airport CEO. And first of all, I would just like to point out how stupid I was in the last episode with this international zoning. We've not been able to do the passports. <laughs> I had a comment left just to tell me to just to rotate them. <laughs> and that will simply fix the issue. So, um, I think I'm going to have to do that now because, as you can see here, the international zoning is marking up with uh, no exit point. So, um, even though I'll put the bloody elevators and thinking now so um let's go ahead and do what i was originally hoping to do so um let's do this and show us a passport um we could just have the automated ones going in the morning and i suppose must be connected to a secure zone what what okay. let me just get rid of these um oh I always forget to turn that on. So that's F10 and then clicking on uh, simulate construction. So. Oh, that's why that's not marked as secure. So. Man. Oh my god, select it. <laughs> so, we want it this way, don't we now? To go out, so. There we go. I, I think just the automated ones going out. So now, hopefully, that should have changed. Oops. Not that then. Oh, what? Have I? I put on the right way. Yeah, they're going that way. So what if I put them uh, bushes back there? Is that going to work? Come on. Okay. What? Um, um, yeah, I thought that was going to do it. I wonder if I need to put one of these in then. But no. You want to thought so. Passport checker is operating. So, so is that added it onto. This original count over here, 13. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Well, wow. obviously not then. What? Well done, wrong guys. Security exit 1. Do you know what? I thought that was going to fix it. Let me just try if this. If I get rid of this then. Secure zones. Security. Let's go for the, um, the, the full on checkpoint. So they're going to come that way and then they're going to work this in out. I'm just going to see if this works. No. What? Uh, security, security checkpoints. There's nothing in there, is there? So, okay. So, I thought that was the way I was going to do it. Right. So, I'm going to ignore this thing, guys. And leave it how I was. Um, and I'll... If you know why it's still not working, let me know. I thought it was just going to be... What? How's that even happened like that? I thought it was just going to be a matter of just changing... Um, rotating them. Uh, well, thank you very much for leaving the comment for that. Uh, but uh, for some reason, it's still not working. Unless I've done it, I've left, I've marked it wrong. I couldn't have marked it. I'm just going to check over this again, just because. Yeah, I, I, I can imagine you just shouting at me now, like, "What's it doing? It's doing it totally wrong." Just know it. 
And I do feel a bit stupid. So, as far as it can go, is there. Right. So, I wonder if them. Um, it could be a bug. Oh my, do you know what? I'm not going to waste any more time on it, guys, because I can just be here all day doing this. Um, oops. Um, I can come back and change it anyway, can't I? So, right, let's put these uh, edges back in place. There we go. Right, so the idea is then to go down here, come out here, and then come in here. Um, and I was going to build... Checking put a check out, uh, sorry, a um, actually, I might make, make this bit bigger because I, I need to put somewhere to put the baggage claim. So, uh, yeah, so right, if you are new to uh, this video series, yeah, I'd just like to say, um, this is it started off being Singapore airport and then it uh, I just decided against it because it, it I couldn't follow it properly so um, right so uh, we're looking for walls um, oh my god I am useless at going around these menus I really am so right I, I'm 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 doing this in the total wrong order, aren't I? So we need to do the baggage. Or should we just get this up and running and then do the baggage afterwards? Or uh, as for the internet, excuse me, for the um, for the um, allow medium aircraft on a large stands. Now, um, unless do you need baggaging for? International is a definite. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I should, um, need to get some thinking. Thinking, I can't think. My brain's not working again, guys. <laughs> uh, I do apologize. Um, so, what do we need? Baggage bay, but we need this. Where I don't want to put it, I can't put it there because that's where the exit point's going to be. So it's going to need to be it must be indoors. Where am I going to put this? Hmm. Oh, decisions. I'll pull it. I'm going to want it on either side. Probably could do it underneath, couldn't I? Because then the, the, the conveyor belts can go down and drop down straight into it. And then they could come up, up here. Let's try and do that, guys. Know me, I'll rip it all up at some point again. So we're going to go. I'm gonna go down here. Should I get this closer? Or should I just have it there? Oops, no, I didn't want that there. I wanted it there. <laughs> um, where's that gonna pull that? Yeah. And then put that on the end there as well. And then we can do the service road. Like I say, it's not going to be exactly the same on each side. That's not the plan. And then we can do terminal underneath. Um, oh, we're going to have one each, one each side. 
One's enough, I think. Don't know how much, how big we need this. Some conveyor belt baggage bay. Can be placed on walls, so we need to rip them walls up, don't we? Don't forget, guys, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and leave a like on the video. Um, I noticed I've been getting a few dislikes actually on this uh, this this video series. Um, I'm just wondering why. If, um, if you aren't there hitting that dislike button, I would like to know what, what what you think I'm doing wrong. Or always like to hear the feedback. Um, so conveyor baggage bay. Put that there, and then we can go all the way around it with a service road. Not there. Mm -mm -mm. Just need to take a bit of more wall out. Wall, wall out. Rip that up there. Um. Service road. No. Nope. What am I doing? Oops. There we go, right, that's how I envision it. And then that can be brought up and then it can be feeded into these um, these bits over here. Uh, so let's do a similar thing on the other side. Does it let me put the baggage? No, I don't need to put the uh, foundation down first, don't you? Rip them walls up, not them walls, and then uh, baggage, baggage bay again. There we go. Huh. Huh. Do I like that? Did I ever like that? And then. Let's get back onto the road, select that service road, concrete, and then just go all the way around. Uh, just don't need to nip one of the walls out. Can we not do that with that? I should. Is there a shortcut for this bulldozer control? No. Um, concrete, there we go. Right, okay. Alright, sorted, so uh, let's get these connected up then somehow, shall we? Um, so, baggage, we're going to go for the high speed, I think. And, and then we're going to have to put all the, uh, the checks in as well. Below it. So, high speed, that's when we can, I'll have it drop in this side I think, so get that joined up there. No, that's not what I wanted you to do. What? There we go. We've got this. I don't know if the sound's a bit low. It's a bit on my speakers, I don't know if uh, that's made any difference, but uh, it is nice chilling music to listen to. Right, so we've connected all them up and now we need to go down. Why? This always confused me because look at that there, it looks like it's going the wrong way. There you go, that's better. Um, so, let's go down. So that's going to go down to there. And now we need it either going up or down. I'm depending. So, how am I going to do this then? Slow that down for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, don't really need to care about it. So if we go here, 
Shall we have it going through all the scan first things first before it ventures off to whichever direction it needs to go into? I should really go somewhere. Um, some terminal, shouldn't I? For this. Not that, yeah. I don't, you don't actually need it to be fair, because no one actually goes down and like does any maintenance or anything on it. And I don't know if that's going to be a thing later on or not, but uh, we'll see. So, right, let's have it going. Up, and then we'll start it going through some of the security. Right. It's going to be very cautious here and just put, make sure I get it the right way. We're going to have. That's, yeah, that's for the. Uh, to have a person on it. That I can see why you would need then the, the foundation because you need someone to be on that. But I'm just going to put all these in place here, I think. Um, Oh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, we're not going to have enough room, so. Have my look. Just leaving the one gap between them. Um, I'm going to have to make it bigger, aren't I? I am indeed. I shouldn't need all that, but we'll see. Right. Um, baggage. What did I get? I've done three amateurs, so that would be ex explosives, and then let's go to drugs. And money. Give me the money. Right, so. I always seem to mess this up by putting these on the wrong way around, but uh, never mind. So, we'll have this coming up here. into a destruction bit. Right, so that's that connected there and then baggage destroyer. Put that on the end there. Hopefully that will not why did it do that? I don't understand why it just decides that it's gonna go the other way for some reason. Right, and then from here it can go up there. Oops, I need to put a tilt in. Um, let's get rid of that and put a kind of confusing. Put a tilt there and then down here and then we're going back down here to this one over here. What I can do is I'll just what I'll do is foundation. Let's connect this up by this here. Um, it's just typical. I'm like a little bit out there. <laughs> like I say, it's not going to be 100% perfect on either side. Rip these walls out. Do the same on the other side. And then let's attempt to connect these up, shall we? Where's my eye speed? All right, so let's go down here. I'm gonna go quite close to the wall. Oh, typically it has to be on the other side. Um, all right, so that's gonna be that then. I'm gonna go now because that's just gonna block it off altogether, isn't it? Oh, it's a pain that. Why? It'd be nice if you could swap, swap it around and you got an option, that would be great. Oh, airport's closed. Yeah, no, airport's closed. Um, right. Do it like that. That's that side hooked up. And then, see, this is this side's all right. I'm going to keep to... Or should I keep to the wall? I don't think it really matters, does it? It's... Uh, There we go. Fingers crossed that's going to work. So, check in there. 
bags go down to whichever. So I'm going to mark. So basically, um, one of these stands have gone out of their own um, baggage bag. Oh, it's probably an overkill. Um, but it's fine. And now we need to do a bit for when it comes back up to the claim area. And um, we're going to. Oh, I could have it here. That would have been perfect. We'll just have it here, I think. Um, or should we? Because when I come up. Oh, yeah, excuse me. Oh. Um, so if I come up here. Yeah. Hmm. How should we do this, guys? Where do you reckon on that one, then? Where do you reckon I should do the baggage claim? I'll leave that one up to you. Um, please drop the comments below on that, on an idea for that. Yeah, so that's that in place. So we. Well, what else do we need to do? Baggage banging service is disabled. Um, so, operations close still, activate ramp agent, uh, activate ramp agent, okay, we've done that, uh, requirements, an open baggage claim area, okay, so we can't actually turn it on yet, because I haven't done the baggage claim area. Um, but I'd like you to decide on that one guys so I'm going to call this a video thanks for all the support guys and I'll see you soon